Okay, hold on. Turn to the left now. She's trying to capsize on us right now. Uh, these waves are just hitting it really awkward. Want to keep up with the latest Komodo gaming videos? Be sure to subscribe and click that bell. Hello YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Stormworks Build and Rescue. And yes, folks, we are back once again, and today marks the return of Sinking Tuesday. So, I've kind of spread out my sinking episodes kind of over the summer, and they weren't really in any particular order, but I want to bring Sinking Tuesday back, because a lot of people are back in school, so I kind of want to tidy up my schedule a little bit, that way you know which days we're actually going to do Sinking Tuesday. Now, we'll still have some multiplayer coming up here really soon, but I just wanted to let you guys know that Sinking Tuesday is officially back. So today, we're going to be checking out this massive oil tanker. Now, we've done plenty of oil tankers before. Uh, this one has to be spawned in with a custom mission. Uh, it's made by Memp, and it does have a lifeboat system here. Now, I don't have very much luck with these lifeboat systems. I always seem to manage to break it off uh, before we even try to use it. So let me go ahead and look into here. Uh, this one looks really simple. It's just a one button release off the railing system and drops down into the water. So that's our means of survival today. And if we lose that, yeah, that's going to be very, very bad news. Now, another thing I want you guys to notice, look how smooth this is running. Uh, they finally implemented some of the uh, optimizations that were in the experimental branch into the normal updates. And this is a pretty big ship, and I'm having pretty much no issues uh, so far. So, let's go ahead. We're going to hop up into, I think this is called the superstructure, I believe. Let's go and get into here. We need to get rolling here. Weather's going to be pretty nasty today, so we're going to have to be pretty patient here. All right, so I just now realized the only way to get to the bridge, you actually have to go through the back here, up these stairs. Okay, that's a, a little odd. Okay, so let's go up to here. All right, so here's the bridge, and uh, we should be ready to move out here. Let's see what kind of features this ship has. Oh, yeah, we've got screens. Oh, that's fantastic. There's thermal clothing. Let's go ahead and turn these on. I noticed some doors weren't working downstairs, so I think we need to activate everything. What's this over here? Okay, so it's oil pump. Let's go ahead and activate this. Uh, let's give it a little bit of throttle. Let's go ahead and starter. There we go. Okay, so that's one engine up. Uh, this is your autopilot over here, so let's go ahead and throttle this up all the way. All right. Uh, oil pump's on. Starter's off. Let's see. We have our foghorn. Let's go ahead and turn navigation lights on. Uh, let's see. We got... Red lights is going deck lights, front lights, and the white lights are on right now. All right, we should be ready to move out. Let's go ahead and start to roll forward here. There we go. Nice and smooth. All right, check that out. That looks pretty incredible. All right, so we're going to start to move here. All right, that is actually staying on. I'm always so afraid of these lifeboats on this. I can't tell you how many, and I think it's just a pretty standard thing for oil tankers to have these uh, pods on the back, at least from what I've seen here in Stormworks. I always lose them. Like, I'll be just kind of going along in a storm, and then I'll notice, wait, where did the life pod go, or where's the lifeboat? <laughs> oh, boy. Let's hope we don't lose that here today. All right, so we're going to get out pretty deep. Uh, I want to hit some huge waves here today. I want it to be more like a classic episode of uh, Sinking Survival. By the way, what's our fuel situation like? All right, there we go. Now, another thing I should note, uh, Memp always, and I think I'm saying that right, always puts a scuttle feature on the ship. So, f say for whatever reason this thing isn't going down, worst case scenario, we're using the, uh, the scuttle button. But I'm going to try to make this go down with just kind of waves and... Maybe it'll capsize. That'd be cool. All right, let me go ahead and check out this lifeboat real quick. So there's your brakes. So I think in the, I'm thinking the brakes are actually what's holding it up on the rail right now. So if we need to release that, we should pop down. Hopefully the door is like automatic or something, and we should be good to go there. All right, so let's see what we're dealing with here. Yeah, we've been on quite a few oil tankers. Uh, they all are pretty feature packed. I think this one's morally, uh, since it is a mission, I don't know how functional this one is. I know this creator has another one on the workshop that uh, actually is really cool. Uh, it's one of the top workshop items. It works for career mode, which is really cool to see. Uh, let's go on a little visual tour here. Hold on, let's go under. Are there actual tanks in this thing? Hold on, let's go into here. All right, well, you know what? This is a functional one too. You can see the tanks. So you got your pipes coming down. Uh, these will hold the uh, different liquids, which I think mostly in career mode. Yeah, there's pumps here too. 
Yeah, mostly in career mode, you're going to be like carrying around fuel. And I think you can take fuel from several points and go sell them, which is really cool. I don't know if I would ever do that on a video because obviously you're just going to go uh, fill up the tanks, take it over and dump it off and sell it. Uh, that's been the one weird thing about some of the career mode stuff that it takes a long time. And it's just like, I don't know if you guys would actually find some of that stuff entertaining. So uh, let me know down in the comment section below. Maybe one day, uh, once the game gets really, really stable, uh, we'll start another career mode up. Because that was basically what you did uh, when the game first came out. And then they kind of got it to where you can spawn in these missions, get huge boats, and they started adding a bunch of other features. Uh, okay, let's see. Let's go ahead and go up here. We're going to go on a little tour real quick. Actually, I want to go down here. Uh, let's look inside this. Just see if there's anything I should be made aware of here. All right. So this appears to be... Ooh, what's this? Wait, is this... Uh, this kind of looks like this would have been the engine room. These look like dummy panels, though. Yeah, wait, no. This wouldn't be an engine room, would it? Anybody that's familiar with a uh, tanker, what is this room supposed to be? Those look like they would be pumps of some sort, or maybe something's flowing through? What does this say? No, this all looks like dummy, or basically I say dummy panels for uh, just show. Uh, let's go ahead, we'll go up to the next level. All right, so we do have some cabin doors here, so this looks like the crew quarters on the next floor. And then I think this moves up to, can we go off the back here? Okay, so we can go out the back deck here. I don't know why I'm using, okay, hold on, if we go up here, Wait, there's one more level I'm missing here. Hold on, let's go into here. And let's use this ladder here to get up and check and see what is this exactly. Now, I do believe uh, this uh, interior is pretty bare right now. And I think that's probably to save on the frame rate. Also, me and Stormark's ladders don't get along. There we go. Alright. Oh, this door seems to be disconnected. Alright, so we have a cafeteria here. And we have your mystery meats over here in a grill. Alright, that's pretty cool looking. Okay, well... I think that's about it for the tour. That's one thing about these uh, tankers. They're so huge, but there's not really that much to look at uh, because most of the stuff's going to be back here. And then, of course, it's just large tanks in the bottom. All right, folks, it's time to start kicking up these waves and seeing what we got here. So, I see spotlights. Is there a spotlight control? Hold on, do we have... What light is this? It's red lights, white lights, deck lights, and front lights. Uh, is there an additional control out here for the spotlights? I don't know if we can light those up any further. We're probably going to need them because, yeah, we've been going for quite a while now. And I'm pretty sure we're getting into some really, really deep water. Which is good for us because you're going to get some epic waves. I'm going to go ahead and set the autopilot real quick. Uh, let me check. We don't have any sort of survival besides the, uh, the thermal clothing here. I don't think we have any sort of scuba gear or anything like that so we need to keep that in mind hold on another little check okay it's still there <laughs> that's good <laughs> all right let's uh let's keep moving here what was that what what was that what are you serious i heard the oh you gotta be kidding me right y you gotta be kidding me uh, is there any way to keep these little back things on? I knew this was going to happen. This has happened to me multiple times. <laughs> I was just sitting here kind of enjoying the ride out to the uh, the point way out here. And then I heard the uptick and I kind of looked in one of the rear cameras. I was like, I thought I saw something orange move by. Yeah, that was it. Well, not much I can do about that. Okay. <laughs> well, I don't... Oh, man. What is the options here? Uh, I guess stay with the ship? Uh, we're getting into some really heavy waves right now. Not too bad at the moment. Man, that kills me. That's another one that's fallen off. You know, I almost think there should be like another system on those. You can have the railing and then have like a couple like magnets attached to it that you need to release too. That's crazy. Uh, okay. All right. Well, we're not getting away that way. All right. Weather's really starting to pick up here. I feel so hopeless now. Like we don't have a way off the ship anymore. Uh, okay, hold on, let's check. How big are these waves? Ah, uh, fairly big. I've seen bigger. Uh, not too bad right now. Okay, just keep holding on here. We'll be okay. Alright, let's just kind of, uh, buckle down here. Alright, so I got 10 kilometers to where I think it's gonna be, like, really, really, really massive waves. So I'm gonna continue just, uh, cruise out this way. I have my autopilot on right now. 
Uh, we should probably do a little status check. We don't have anything even spilling over the deck right now. Everything looks perfectly fine at the moment. Oh boy. You know what I figured out? What might have happened? Check out what this ship does. Okay, watch when the, uh, the propellers come out of the water here. So it stalls out and then it goes BOOM! That's what ripped that lifeboat off. I, I remember hearing the RPMs pick up because the propeller in the back came up out of the water and then when it jerked forward, that's what actually released the lifeboat. Okay, so at least I think we uh, came to a conclusion as to what's happening here. This is rough. Like, okay, the waves are really big, but watch this. Wait for it to come up. You'll hear the RPM pick up here in just a second. Okay, here it is. Dude, yeah, you see that? That is ridiculous. Man, that's catching me off guard. Okay, you gotta be really careful when we walk around on deck here. That would fling you off the back. If you were sitting there with no railing, you'd be gone. Okay, you keep moving. Okay, let's not stand there. I want to go down on the deck here. I don't want to stand close when it picks up RPM, though. Okay, let's go. Okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. Oh, no, no, I almost just fell off that. Okay, we're good. Uh, just kind of stay down. Hold on, toggle that. All right, let's go through here to get down to the, uh, the bottom deck here. All right, turn that on. Also, the flashlight looks a little weird now since the update. Uh, it's like it's strobing or something. Okay. Holy man. By the way, it is in the middle of the day right now. The storm's just that intense at the moment. Uh, I think we'll be okay, though. Uh, let's see. Do we see any islands or anything close? Uh, I need to find, like, an alternate route to escape here. I guess the good thing is we are going with the waves at the moment. Uh, let's see. Anything? Hold on. Let's get up to the front here. Okay. Seven kilometers from our destination. Look at those waves rolling. Oh, those look ridiculous. That is one of the most awesome things about Stormworks. Like, those uh, those waves are amazing. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Tilting up a little bit. Okay, we're good. Oh, it's going to do it again. And then... Oh, it wasn't that severe up here. It's way worse on the back. Whew. Okay, that was a little bit of a jump there. All right. Let's go and get to the back. I don't feel like we've gotten to the most intense waves yet. All right, so it took us a good 30 minutes to get to our waypoint, but folks, I think I have found an extremely deep portion of the ocean. Now, another thing is, man, I kind of wish we had a bit more light here. It is really hard to see. Uh, I could adjust it back to day, but I mean, it looks amazing. Like you can see the lights coming back onto the deck. I really wish I knew how to activate these spotlights. There's not an extra button around here. Uh, let's see. Scuttle buttons here. Heaters there. This is infrared lights. Um, anything? Is there a hidden button somewhere? Man, uh, I feel like those are hooked up somewhere, but I just can't locate it. This is all engine starter. Which that all looks good. All right. Let's keep moving. Wait. Is it raining? Well, wait. I feel like that's a graphical glitch. I can see the stars, but it is pouring down. Like, the rain is set to max. I figured it would look a little, I guess you could say, more gross than this. By the way, I don't think we're... We're hardly moving right now. Yeah, there it goes. Yeah, this thing keeps getting kind of stuck up on waves. All right, let's keep moving. We're probably going to start to turn a little bit here. Uh, do we have any islands? Uh, let's check. I don't see anything that's visible on the map right now. All right, I think I can see the ocean floor, so we're not the deepest we could be, but let's keep moving, and we'll see what happens here. Oh, buddy. Okay, we've gotten out even deeper. Check these waves out right now. These, they're not quite as bad as the Arctic waves. That they get, like, absolutely horrible, but this is about some of the bigger waves that you would find towards the bottom of the map. Oh, yeah, there is not an island in sight right now. That's actually a little scary. Uh, <laughs> all right, I think we're gonna be okay. You know, this would be a lot better if we had a, uh, we had a life. Well, actually, I don't know if I'd want to be on that in these waves. I was like, man, I'd like to get into the lifeboat, but yeah, I'm not sure about that. Uh oh, uh oh. Whoa. Okay, hold on. Turn to the left now. She's trying to capsize on us right now. Uh, these waves are just hitting it really awkward, and it doesn't help when it goes up in RPM and then it jerks forward. It actually sends it sideways sometimes. Uh, that might be the death of us. All right, let's go ahead and do another. Ooh, okay, stay down. I want to fall off this. Let's do another check. Oh, that is so dangerous. Okay, 
Uh, get in the door. Okay, on. Oh, 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 geez, I just got flung against the back railing there. All right, close this. Let's make our way up to the cafe. Uh, hold on, look down real quick. Okay, we look good there. I don't know what's wrong with the flashlight right now. It's a little weird. Holy man. Okay, uh, let's wait. No, I can't get to the... Can I get to the back deck from here? Uh, does that railing lead around? Okay, I got to be very careful about that railing. Ooh. Oh, no, she's tipping again. She's tip. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Okay, uh, all right. She just did. Whoa, no, no. Oh, I thought I was going to get thrown over there. Did she just do a flip? All right. Oh, you can hear the RPMs jerking up and down. It's definitely... Wait, no, we're good. We're good. Nope, there it goes again. Did we just flip? I, fi I feel like we just flipped. Hold on, look out. <laughs> okay, you know what? We better get to the bridge. Uh, We didn't break apart or anything, did we? Hold on, let's go check the front. That always concerns me when you flip over and that much force gets onto the hits the deck, I guess you should say. Uh, no, we're in one piece right now. We just completed... Oh, okay, that's another big hit right there. Uh, okay, you know what? Let's go. Oh, this is just so dangerous right now. Look at that thing flapping around. I, I think... We did we complete a whole rotation there? I feel like we flipped. I could be wrong, though. Okay, uh, get in here. Ooh, okay, be careful. Okay, well, listen for RPMs. Oh, it's doing it again. Oh, we could have got thrown off there. Okay, go, 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 go. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. Okay, yes. We have made it to the bridge. Jeez, that's crazy. All right, I believe we've cycled around a day. The waves are only getting worse. At least I think it's day. Uh, I believe it is right now. Yeah, it's definitely gotten brighter, so we've been on the ship for a long time. Yeah, I don't think this thing's going down. Uh, I think this thing can actually withstand quite extreme weather, including completely tipping over. Which is uh, pretty amazing, but oh, look at that water. Oh, oh this is going to be a bad hit. That's okay. Well, I think we're good. All right, so I'm trying to turn because I know the islands are back this way. So as soon as I can turn this thing completely to where the waves are going uh, towards the rear of the ship, we'll be good. I know we'll be heading back towards some sort of island. Uh, that's the idea. Oh, man, this is horrible looking. I'm almost tempted since the storms aren't doing anything. I think I'm going to turn them down. And just see what this looks like with the pure waves. All right, let's turn down rain. Or the waves. Oh, the waves are still just as intense. Look at that. Okay, we are almost turned around here. All right, keep going. Keep turning. This thing does not feel good right now. Do I have damage? I don't know. It's, the engine sounds sick. I know it's not out of fuel. Or is it? Hold on. Uh, fuel, 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 fuel. What's fuel levels? Uh, fuel. No, there's plenty of fuel in here. But man, there's like no RPMs right now. Uh oh. Ooh, look at that water splashing over. Wow. Wait. Are we taking on water from somewhere? Hold on. Open the door. Look around. Did we sustain some sort of damage? I don't think we did. I need to get into photo mode real quick and we'll do a little uh, observing, see if I see anything. Oh, let's get into photo mode real quick. Okay, resume time here. Uh, look for damage. Surveying. Doors closed. Why are we going down right now? No, we're definitely going down. What the heck? Hold on. Check the bottom. Did the doors come open? No, this is the scuttle feature here. They look closed. Is there a rear one? Hold on. Look for a rear. Or is it just the fronts? I think it's just the fronts. Oh, it's just bogged down for some reason. Hold on. Uh, is it getting foggy? No, it's not. It's just the lights. Oh, that was a huge wave right there. Okay, uh, just hold on for a second. I think we're fine. Uh, folks, we have a bit of an issue here. I don't think our engine's on. Uh, look, all the... Wait, why are these all dropping? The engine's dead. Hold on. Uh, let's see. Fuel pumps are on. Okay, let's go ahead and... Uh, see if we can start it. What the heck? Uh, wait, why? Hold on. Why is it stalling out? Okay, watch the RPM. I'm assuming this is RPMs, right? No, RPS is who over here. Okay, let's see. Fuel, fuel's drain. No, fuel's level now. What is going on? Okay, starters. I don't know why the lights flicker purple. 
Come on. Okay, you know, reset fuel pump. Okay, engine throttle. Okay, let's go. Fuel pump on. What is going on? Why won't this stay cranked? Uh. What? Are we stranded? Are you serious? Okay, the ship's still. I mean, the ship looks a little bit. L Wait, no, it's definitely lower. Okay, we're. We're sinking. Uh, we're sinking big time. I don't have scuttle on. You know what? Uh, I kind of want to go back down in photo mode. What if one of those doors is open? Oh, you know what? A lot of the bouncing. I don't think we're. How deep are we, real quick? Hold on, look down. All right, we're pretty deep in this area. Uh, okay, for whatever reason, we're sinking. I don't know if we've hit something. Okay, wait, what do I do? Uh, <laughs> I don't even know what to do. There's like no options right now. It's not like we can get on the lifeboat and leave. We left that way back there. Are you serious? Uh, is this how it's gonna end? We're just gonna sink here? Uh, okay, confirm there is no, there is no, no scuba gear on right now. Okay, well, I guess this is how it's gonna be. So this would be the point in time, this is like the scariest feeling ever. We would be calling the Coast Guard and saying, hey, can you come get us? We're, uh, we're going down right now. It's not going down fast at all. Like, it's a slow leak, whatever it is. Uh, also, the sun's going down. Are you serious? Is this going to really hit? Oh, okay, hold on, hold down. Uh, those waves are starting to hit the bridge. Okay, you know what? This is probably where we want to stay here. Uh, folks, I'm at a... Uh-oh. Uh oh is it going? Oh, ho, 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 ho. Okay, you know what? Should we hold on to the back? I don't want to go down with this thing. On. Okay, climb up to the top here. Are you serious? Okay. Ooh. Oh, oh, okay. Uh, is there any other thing? Do they have like a life preserver or something around here? Like a little ring or something that I can hold on to? Uh, I think that's going to be a big uh, negative ghost rider. I th think, yeah. So, I have a theory. I was able to see the bottom of the ocean way back there when we were in those rough waves. Did we bounce and maybe lock? I didn't see really any damage though. Okay. Water's getting in somehow. All right, you know what? Ooh, let's investigate before we uh, <laughs> before we die here. Okay, Ooh, okay, almost got killed by the ship. Look at that. Okay, look at the doors. Doors are closed, that door's closed. Did I leave a back deck? No, a back deck door wouldn't have flooded that much. The damage, wherever the flood was, it was coming from the front. Uh, okay, I'm gonna go down. Ooh, yeah, there's, there's gotta be, well, what the heck was that? There's gotta be something here that's sinking it, and, well, wait, is it kind of stall? It might have stalled out, oh, I'm dying. Wait, why am I dying? Oh, look for sharks. Okay, you know what, we're just gonna plant ourselves up here. This is probably the safest area that we could be in. Well, there's your, uh, sinking. I really wish we had a way off this thing. Uh oh, oh, and duck down. <laughs> okay. Well, this was a weird one here. Uh, is there anything inside? Any islands? You know, this would be so cool if you can get AI to come pick you up. Because this would be the perfect opportunity. I'd be like, hey, AI, can you come get me? Uh, we are stranded out here. Okay. Well, I guess we're just going to watch it go down. <laughs> we don't have an option. So, are you folks prepared for probably one of the saddest endings here? It's about to turn night, and our boat... He is pretty much gone. Well, this is uh, not a very fun feeling, is it? Oh, <laughs> here it goes. Uh, all right, so she's down. Obviously, there was water affecting something on the inside because the engines were, I guess, flooded. So I'm assuming that maybe the air intakes were flooded wherever they are. So that, I guess that's why our engine wasn't working. And yep, we are now in this situation. There goes the sun. Here are the high waves. And here's a Komodo out in the middle of the water. Well, that was a return to sinking survival. But anyways, I think that's going to wrap it up for this episode. Uh, I think we'll do some more multiplayer sinking survival. I just wanted to play with some of the bigger creations here in Stormworks and uh, try out something. Still cannot get any luck with those lifeboats, though, on these things. Uh, they always seem to fall off the rails for me. <laughs> but anyways, I want to thank you guys for all the love and support on the Stormworks series. You guys are absolutely amazing, and we will see you guys next time.